Hey guys, welcome to Path to Nowhere. We have here a update for tomorrow, February 21, exactly a week after Valentine's Day. So this will be, we will have a server maintenance on the 21st, 5 to 9 UTC. So that, that, that's approximately four hours of uh, non-playing. You won't be able to log into the game. And also guys, um, we have some compensation here. 200 hyper cubes and 60 stamina so collection condition you have to log in with the mill function un unlock before 27th uh, for you to get the compensation of course and the mail will expire after seven days so what do we have for this update basically new content limited time event so favorite fortune starts this is a new event so fortune exchange ticket to draw prices from the pool Exclusive two-star attire for Cinnabar, which I won't be discussing. Um, have here warrants and other rewards awaiting for you. So Unbridled Wanderer, routine arrest starts. Uh, routine arrest is going to be your existing character, which they will put up as a rate up banner. Uh, Increase for a limited time. And uh, let's... Uh, if, if you don't know who Bai is, so the drop rate increase is going to be for Bai. Um, sorry, sorry for that one. Just want to pick up my. Um, uh, okay, I haven't checked in yet. Uh, guilty as charged. And um, to want to go through <laughs> Bai here. Um, again, I uh, just want to give you guys a short. For those who don't really know who she is and. And how important she is in the game. She has multiple core breaks. She has the ability to break multiple cores. Again, um, just by moving around. Um, this is going to be her bread and butter. Her ultimate. And um, she has a very fast attack. Crit rate is actually good for her. Very nice, solid damage um again she is one of the best that we have so if you don't have her or if you need to unshackle more like me i haven't i haven't unshackled a lot here for bai only one copy so far uh very shameful so if i indeed want to increase her crit rate which is actually recommended then therefore I should be able to pull for her banner, but I'm waiting for the next banner to arrive. So um, probably could get her off banner some other way. At this point, um, if you don't have her yet, please do get her. She is actually so, so, so nice to have. It makes the game easier, um, if I may say. Um, again, guys, Hopefully that you I've already unlocked 100% uh, your compliance. So she's compliant <laughs> for the warden. So that is it, guys. I, I won't, you know, go delve into her skills, her shackle, her crime brand. I already made a guide, a build guide for her. If you happen to want to know what it is, just in case you pull for her tomorrow or probably you have her and you haven't built her right already. Please check that out. I'll probably put a you know a link somewhere up there so that you could uh, you could check on that video. And moving back to let's go back to oops, let's go back to our update. We also have um, new attire for her. So Bai Blade of Night three star attire is available for a limited time. Let's uh, let's see that. Um, Attire once and for all. Let me just click on that. If you slash a blade fast enough, there you go. This is one of those attires that I think is worth buying. This makes her really bad ass. Really, really, really bad. Very, 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 very bad assassin. Not bad in a bad sense, but uh, really makes her really, uh, what do they call this, uh, stand out. So that is it. Let's go back. So again, it's going to be available. I'm sure it's going to be, be available through the store. 
I'm probably going to be getting it. So, again, highly recommend. If you don't have Bai, please get her. Please. Because she is going to be part of your main group of sinners that you will rely on consistently. Okay, so added two-star attires basic dynamic effects. So if you have an existing one, there's a dynamic effect already. The dynamic effect includes idle anima and animation and click animation effects. Add new mail archive function after the update and need specific conditions will be automatically collected to archive mail after the reward is received. And add a new attire avatar function. Obtain attires. The corresponding attire avatar will be unlocked in the chief info section. So also we have here um, some fixes, small fixes, typos, optimizations here, uh, mark screening function, optimized list displays for sinners. Add new attire switching function, which is nice. Click on easily between two kinds of display effects, sinner detention portrait and sinner current attire. So those are just um, small fixes that so that we could enjoy this game much. And that is it. So it's a small update, which leads me to the next update. If you already have buy, please do save up for the next update because the next banner would be a new character and definitely most of you guys should have as well. I won't discuss that new character probably um, right before she drops. Uh, it's a clue. She drops. Then we'll be talking about her. So anyway, at this point, thank you very much, guys, for staying this far. Take care. Stay safe. This is the Warden, and I'm out of here.